This is a Spree Model Network TV and you're watching How To Jetty Programming. Today I'm joined by James who's going to help us explain your Jetty 2.4 duplex transmitter. Hey guys, James with the Spree Model and Jetty USA. Uh, going to do a quick video with you today on how to set up flapper on or spoiler on on an aircraft that doesn't have separate flaps or spoilers. Uh, so this would be your small pylon racer, your two surface EDF, uh, something like your Habu 32X that guys are really building out there right now. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to set up a model. We're going to walk you all the way through. The easiest way to set up flapper on it does do a, a little bit of mixing. First thing you want to do is set up the model. I'm going to create a special model for this. Um, this is going to, we'll just knock in a couple of letters here so we know we can get back to it. We're going to build an airplane. And then the wing type is where it's critical. We're going to go ahead and choose a two aileron single flap wing. Uh, what this will allow you to do is, is mix flaps into the ailerons. Uh, tail, that's going to be up to whatever you're building. Uh, go ahead and leave the controls as they are and we'll move all the way through the setup. Once we've created the model, it gets easier from here. All right, what we're gonna do is because we've set up flaps and we've set up ailerons, uh, flaps are controlled off our slider P5. We're gonna go into our fine tuning and into our free mixes, and we're gonna create a mix. And what we wanna do is we wanna add a mix. We're gonna click on from, we're gonna add our flaps as our master. We're going to mix that to ailerons and we're going to give it a baseline value of say 70%. We'll go ahead and scroll that up to 70%. Once we've done that we can click on next. If you want to go into the advanced settings you just click the edit button That'll take you into the advanced settings and you can change the curve. Change, changing the curve is where you're going to kind of control the direction of the flaps. Um, keep in mind when you're setting that master mix, let me back out to that. Uh, that value uh, for positive and negative is going to change. Uh, if you're trying to set uh, flapper on where the ailerons go down on the flap switch, uh, you may have to change that to a positive or negative value to get the movement that you want to. Um, so that's something you're going to have to do on your own. You're also going to have to play with that value to come up with the right number in the flaps or in the mix so that as you move the flap slider, uh, the ailerons move in conjunction. So we're going to go ahead, jump back into the main menu, so we'll exit back, go to the monitor, and we're going to move the flap switch. Let's go ahead and check where our ailerons are. You see them on two and four. Now if you move the, uh, the flap switch, you can see that our ailerons are moving. Um, so we have added flapper on or spoiler on depending on a positive or negative value to the master mix. Uh, that's it. If you have any questions on that, like always, you can reach out to us at Esprit Model uh, or Jetty USA. Thanks, and we'll see you next time.